150 years ago, the Rhone Glacier stretched all the way down to this point in the valley. But like all glaciers in the Swiss Alps, it's melting, and melting fast. Three weeks ago, the glacier was here uh, at the stone, and in the last three weeks, the glaciers melt back six meters, and this is extreme. Within the next decade, global warming means that this two cubic kilometer ice block is expected to lose half its volume. This part of the glacier is covered with blankets to try to slow down the impact of climate change and rescue the grotto carved in the ice below. Since eight years, the region here in the ice cave uh, have been covered with this blanket. And this blanket reduced the ice melting in the summer between 50 to 70 percent. The cave is a popular tourist attraction and has been carved into the ice here each year since 1870. But the walk to the entrance keeps getting longer and many visitors fear it will soon disappear altogether. I think it's a good idea to put blankets on it to stop it melting, but I don't think those blankets will be enough. When you go inside the grotto now, it rains like it does on a really rainy day, so I don't think it's going to last much longer. It's a hopeless battle to try to stop the death of the mountain. World leaders will meet in Paris later this year to try and reach a new agreement on slowing climate change. But experts expect just 10% of today's glacier ice in the Swiss Alps will remain by the end of this century. For the Rhone, it may already be too late.